the stream hello 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 welcome back to get a fancy but always vlog back today i don't know i'm going out i'm going shopping i'm going to create content i miss you guys how are you guys doing so i'm in the car i'm just going to the shop i don't know what i'm going to get yet because it's weekend, it's very Christmassy, it's very festive. So you stop, let me go out, show you guys the marina, do a bit of shopping, then we can just see what we can get in town. Let's go. All right. Just to let you guys know, um, I'm shooting with a DJI uh, mobile. I'm in DJI Pocket 2, that's what I'm shooting with, and I have my external microphone. Uh, here and um, the camera is mounted oh thank you very much the bus driver just gave me a chance that's very nice of him yeah so that's what's uh, really nice I got distracted because the bus gave me a chance to you know pass you know especially when you're creating content you get distracted because you have to at the same time you're trying to get to talk to you guys and at the same time focusing on the road so it's really uh, it's really hard you have to be very cautious because you know i'm not saying you could get accident but it's possible you could get you know if you get distracted you could easily get involved in accident so yeah how are you guys doing i miss you guys i hope you guys enjoying amazing videos you know so far i've posted about 12 videos so far this month and, um, that's what i plan to give you guys nothing but the best raw content any day anytime you know that's what i, I want to give you guys because imagine not giving you guys the raw content you want i don't know how it's going to be like you know gonna find you fans uh everything because without you guys i can't create content you guys give me so much joy so much motivation and make me want to create content like quality content every day and at the moment i'm just enjoying time even though it's not perfect you know I'm just enjoying. I'm, I'm so grateful, and I hope you guys are grateful as well. I'll pack in all day, get a bit of shopping done, and then I'll go to Waitrose, get a bit of shopping done, and then I'll also get to the marina and do a bit of content for you guys because it's been so long where you know when I, I last recording in Poised Marina because that's where i start creating content from like that's where most of my amazing quality videos uh, came from so i just thought you know it would be uh, actually a nice day it's not brilliant but since i got this new uh dji pocket 2 i actually haven't created any content around the marina so i just thought it's the best time to talk to you guys show you guys how beautiful this marina is uh, why we chose to live here permanently because it's just it's just amazing. You can't just get enough of this uh, poison. It's pretty amazing. I've I've got my thousand subscribers from Bristol poison, and I got my thousand five hundred subscribers from here. So you know, it's gonna make sense why I want to, why I still want to be here. You know, it's alright. Yeah. So guys, uh, I just wanna take my time to pack now. Okay. The stream I dream Thank you So that's how my day began with amazing music i'm going to the shop to see if i could get some toiletries and some drinks and some amazing festive food so let's get into the video yeah. 
and this is the, the high street right now I'm just uh, going to pop into the shop shortly and then I'll get some shopping done I'm going to New Look and then head to Peacock and then Poundland to see if I could get some bits of um, clothing and some toiletries uh, so these shops here these shops are in Port Set uh, they open I believe half eight nine uh, to five o'clock in the evening uh, they do amazing stuff so let me get in there to see if I could show you guys uh, what these kind of shops do they have a 60 percent sales at the moment so let's see if I could find something for myself At the moment we have to wear a mask uh, so you can see I'm wearing my mask here and protecting everyone and protecting myself as well uh, sometimes it's just worth wearing a mask so that you know you protect yourself and also other people in the store um, at the moment I'm just uh, trying to find a light for the bedroom but I don't think they have the light I'm looking for it's like a very small bulb I want to see if I can find it here Right, so I'm in pound shop now. Everything is a pound. So I think this battery is actually good for um, how do you call it? Um, I think for Christmas lights. So I'm just getting this one here. This one look a little bit big. I'm not sure if that's the one I need. Try this one here. This one look a little bit smaller. I think I actually need the big one for Christmas light. It will if it doesn't work. I just have to return it, I guess. It's three, so I'm getting two of them. I hope the batteries work. Oh, drop. I'm just going to replace it. Yeah. Right, so that's the the batteries. And uh, this is how the pan shop look like. Um, and they have a lot of batteries here. They have Duracell, which is quite stronger, you know. But you never know. Let me see, actually, how much is this one? But it's the same uh, price because sometimes Duracell is actually better than a lot of these batteries. I'm just going to compare to see if they're actually the same. Yeah, um, yeah, same. I think I'll go for the Duracell just, just to be a safe side. Yeah, sorry, Kodak. I'm going for the Duracell at this time the battery keep falling i'll go for the duracell the last one that left here thanks for the christmas light i bet a lot of people coming here to get these batteries because they, they look look at the size it's pretty amazing right so i got two of them now let's continue shopping i'm here to get some toiletries as well since i'm here i thought i take my time to look what we can get um, I also use uh, baby oil, so I'm looking for baby oil at the moment. Um, baby oil, baby oil. Right, looking for baby oil at the moment. Uh, here is my baby oil. Get. I use this baby oil because it's just so perfect I've been using it for many years and a lot of people might ask me what do you use but you know I use baby oil for my face and my skin because I have a dry skin it's actually good to use and also candles because your house have to smell good yeah so I'm getting uh, some candles for this Christmas season so I just thought let me get different colors different scents it's always good to have different scents in the house Yes, uh, candle bit is done. All right, uh, what else do we need? Uh, there's a lot of gloves. There's a lot of baby clothes. So, yeah. Um, there's a lot of party plates. A lot of bowls for pasta. 
There's a lot of stuff, yeah. It is a pound shop, you know, they say everything is a pound, but some of the stuff are more than a pound. But look, most of them are a pound, you know, yeah. All right. Right, so I'm actually looking for two in one. It's one meter, it's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for iPhone charger, but two meters. But this one is actually 1.5. I don't know how good, how long is 1.5. Uh, 1.5 is not that long. I need two meters. Probably give up. Um, to see, this is pound show, but it's two pound here. So you can see here's a ferry. And also we need some bleach for the washroom, for the bathroom. So we get in this one here. This product is actually good, you know. I don't work for them, but you know, I use this to clean. So we're getting that one. Then we also need, um, we don't need it all. We just need some toilet refreshner. Uh, let me see if I can find them. I normally get them here. Yeah, this one here. This one actually smell nice. If you've tried it before, please do let me know because it's pretty amazing. I've used it quite a few times, so please do let me know if you do use them as well. Uh, now, I need to, I'm looking for a safe for for kitchen, but it seems like they only have uh, this one. So I think I need to get a safe from another place. They have this, but I don't know if I could use this because this for stainless and we don't have a stainless product at home. Uh, do we need safe? I think we need safe. I need safe sometimes for the shoes, you know. I use safe this one. I use this safe to clean my white shoes. You know, if you have trainers and you got it dirty and you're looking for something to clean, this product is actually amazing. Try it. If you tried it and it works, let me know in the comment section. All right. And the next bit is platinum spray. So this one, I believe, if you spray your utensils, this will go sparkling, like very, very clean. I don't know. Whether well, it's good or not, fairy is quite a good product, but I'm actually looking for SIF. I'm looking for SIF. I don't think they have the sick I'm looking for here. And also, while I'm here, I just thought I'd get some bean bags. I actually use these bean bags a lot because they're very strong. Uh, they're about, you know, uh, yeah, 50 liters. So probably use it two or three days, you know. It's quite strong, so I prefer using them. You know what? They also have a blue one. I haven't tried a blue one, but you know what? Always go for something that you know is reliable. So I'm here. I'm just getting some nails as well because I need nails for the house. Um, no, it's not. I'm not a DIY person, but you know, since I've been doing the house, it's always good to you know uh, to do things yourself. And I've been doing a lot of the housework, so which. Uh, I think we did an uh, amazing job. So I just thought I got some nails for the balcony and some Christmas lighting. So look what we have here. Uh, this is pretty amazing. So you can put this on your doors. And also this is pretty amazing. Uh, we have some at home. But I thought this looked amazing. Uh, so I'm still in the shop. And this is how the shop looks like. I'm looking for Christmas lights at the moment. Uh, so let's find a Christmas light together. I think I just found the light, uh, but I don't know which one to get. So this 50 lights, I don't need a lot of them. Um, I only need just the 10 lights, yeah, 10 right light, that's all I need. This will do, uh, this will just do the job. So I think, I hope it works. All right, so I just finished shopping. It cost me about 22 pounds. What the fuck? <laughs> all right <laughs> i got a disaster my bag just torn apart this is what you do when you don't have a strong bag i have bags in the car i don't know why i didn't bring the bags but thanks to the gentleman who stopped you know that's amazing thank you so much if you're watching this video thank you for stopping and letting me pack my stuff thank you
All right, so while I'm here, I'm just getting some fresh tomatoes because, you know, when I'm having my fish, you know, sometimes I like it with fresh tomato. Um, if you watch my previous videos, actually, you know, I did a video frying a fish. I always uh, use these fresh tomatoes to go with my my fish. I got some uh, some lime here. I'm going to do a cocktail during uh, the day, you know, just... Yeah, just to, you know, relax at home. And I'm getting some avocado. So I'm just checking avocado as well. Right. So I think this part of the shopping is done. So I have my list on the phone. So I'm just going to check my list now to see what I have left. You know, while I'm here, you know, I just thought, you know, why not get this, this uh, pineapple chunks for a cocktail later. So let's continue this part of the, the shopping. Oh, sorry. Right, I'm also getting these bits for afternoon lunch or dinner, tea, you know, some nibbles. I'm just checking to make sure, you know, they look good and they have a lot of prawns in them. Checking this one here, espresso caramel. I don't know that it tastes nice. It's a lot of ice creams here, and um, I actually don't know which one to choose. So I'm still looking. This one looks pretty amazing. I haven't tried this. Maybe I should try it. You know, you never know. All right. So now let's go and get some alcohol. So let's see what they have on the alcohol shelf. I love this shelf because they have so many amazing alcohol. You know, that's a, a green. I mean, how do you call it? like a quality quality prosecco you know look at that you know prosecco is like a version of a champagne i don't know if you guys know and they also have a champagne here but you know i'll go for this one because you know i always believe that expensive prosecco always tastes like a champagne if you agree with me please do let me know in the comment section it's quite amazing they have a lot of uh, nice uh, bottles here it's like I got everything, so the only thing left now to get is uh, egg. Mm, this seems alright, this seems large, perfectly uh, looking yummy, so I can't wait to have them. Alright, this part of the shopping is done, I'm just going to the till now. Alright, so now I'm heading to Waitrose. Uh, which I'm going to flip the camera shortly to show you how the witch rose of poison head look like. Uh, Beth is going to be very busy because it's Saturday and everybody is shopping for Christmas festive food. Let's go get some sushi. Uh, probably for my lunch. I'm not sure if they have uh, some amazing sushi here. So let's get some sushi. So at the moment I'm waiting to get some Christmas food but it seems like I'm struggling. I'm struggling and they have all this amazing food here. Uh, if you're somebody who loves all this delicious looking food, let me know because they look pretty amazing. Now you can see here there's a mailbox here uh, which is one of my favorite from uh, Mendoza, you know. I don't know, is there something about this wine from Mendoza that I really like so much, uh, and it's Melbeck. 
if you like her but please do let me know in the comment section because it's always good to know what uh, my my viewers are having because oh, this is quite nice as well this is from mendoza region as well it's pretty amazing right so now i'm heading to the champagne session uh, this is one of my favorite champagne it's reduced uh, this one is a sparkling wine um i don't know what is a it's like an english sparkling wine is it not alcoholic i don't know Oh. Bed in the hand. Let's see where it's made from. It's Australian. Mm, this one tastes good, you know. It's 10 pounds. Uh, Lorraine Perrier is also reduced for display only. Oh my god, that's pretty amazing. I actually like the rosy one. Uh, if you had a rosy one, please do let me know because I think this is a special cover. Special one. So it's only for display yeah, shopping. So let's just enjoy this part of uh, the christmas uh, food part and then we can go uh, do the rest of the video right, so i just finished uh, shopping in waitress uh, so i know the weather is pretty bad so what i'll do is i'll see if i could get to the marina and get some content for you guys because i promised uh, to show you guys uh, how the marina look like you know i know it's pretty tight but you know i need to get there Uh, it's pretty amazing, right? If you've been to Portishead or if you know anybody who lives in Portishead, uh, please do let me know. This is pretty amazing. Uh, the boats are quite unique. Uh, uh, that one there is quite a big one there. I'm just going to zoom a little bit so I can get a little bit closer view of this gorgeous marina. I'm just going to walk around uh, a little bit, then we can wrap up the video from the other side of the marina uh, because it's wet. You know the plan was to walk around the whole marina today but i don't think i have enough uh, enough uh, uh, battery uh, to get you across but hopefully next time when the weather is pretty nice i could get you across the marina but um it's not bad at least you still got something uh to for me today yeah how you guys doing how how, how are you guys doing i hope you guys enjoying the content i've been giving you so far is there anything particularly you want to watch on the channel please do let me know if you want to watch a review if you prefer a sit down vlogs or if you like my street style vlog please do let me know did you enjoy my vlogs uh, in uh, in london where i was hopping on trains or uh, tubes did you enjoy that please if you do uh, do let me know because you know I, I like to hear from my fans my viewers to see what you like about the uh, the vlog if you've been to london if you use the tube or you prefer using the bus uh, please do let me know this, this is this pretty amazing i actually like the viking there's quite beautiful uh, ones down there if you watch my previous live stream i got, was invited to uh, the boat by one of the the owners but i didn't have enough time or i arranged uh, plans to uh, go for a visit but you know hopefully uh, next summer i'll definitely contact uh, the gentleman and uh, probably visit them So I just uh, finished shopping now. I uh, went to the marina, did a nice video for you guys, enjoyed it. And so at the moment, I'm just here having a nice drink. You know, sometimes it's always good, you know, to stop a little bit, you know, just to chill. You know, it's always good, you know. I mean, weather's going at the moment, you saw it over the video. But at the moment, this is what they have. They have some amazing menu at the moment. Um, can you see that?
Yeah, so um, I do like this place, you know. A lot of people might not like Wetherspoon, but you know. Uh, one thing I like about this Wetherspoon is they have one of my favorite food, you know, like chicken wings. It's like go-to food anytime I'm hungry. It's just perfect. I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram, you know. I do post on my stories like that delicious looking chicken wings. Yeah, so you can see this way I am right now. Um, I mean, what is point? I'm just having a nice drink. Uh, this drink cost me about three pounds, which is half the price when you're in Bristol or when you're in a proper English pub because Bristol is very expensive. So what is point is like an affordable version of a lot of pubs. So if you're watching and you're coming to the UK and you don't have a lot of money to spend and you want to drink a lot of English beer or British beer, you know, Wetherspoon is actually amazing. I'm, I do not work for them, so I just thought, you know, it's affordable. Uh, most of the stuff here, you can see, they're quite good. Um, let me look. You can see that, right? A drink, a cocktail is about, it's about, you know, less than three pounds. So let me just continue uh, to enjoy my drink. This is every day. It's like office extended until 28th of Feb. That's pretty amazing. Look, why don't you go to Wetherspoon and try it yourself? This is real. This is not fake. Look at that. Do you see the office? It's extended to 28th of Feb. That's pretty amazing. So how are you guys doing? I hope you're enjoying the... I hope you're enjoying the videos I've been posting so far. I've been to London. Uh, I did a driving video. I think I post two of the videos so far. I post one on the uh, social guide and then I post one today uh, on Ghana Fan I hope you guys are enjoying it. Like uh, it was recorded uh, with the Sony. There's no color grading. It's just the natural full frame camera. I told you guys I'm mastering the camera. Mo said before that he can't wait for me to master the camera. And I think I'm doing a great job so far, you know, with the camera, you know, mount the camera on the dashboard recording for three hours i think that's pretty amazing you can imagine the amount of batteries i have on me and also cables charges everything just to be ready you know we were driving for almost three hours in london you if you watch the live stream please do let me know in the comment section because it was pretty amazing content and i went to italy not italy italy i mean italy superstore i went to selfridges i went to zara i went to the registry i went to bond street i went everywhere so you can see i'm giving you all this content all right i just finished uh, weather spoon now i'm just going to head home and then I'll do some cocktails and show you guys how amazing I am making cocktails. But I just thought, you know, sometimes it's good to give you guys um, area view, like where I live and how is the life like in the UK or Portishead. And this is Portishead. Uh, this is where I was uh, earlier. If you watch the videos, this is where I shop and most of the salami and the prawn cocktails and everything. And that's the car park. You can park here for two hours. And that's which road is behind me there. Yeah, so let's get into the car. Let's go make some cocktails. You know, sometimes when you're vlogging, right, people watch. I think sometimes it's nice to stop. Just ask, what are you doing? You know, a lot of people ask. A lot of people ask sometimes, but some people just look like, they look at you like you're some crazy dude, you know, with a camera, with a stick, with a joystick. They want to know what you're doing. I believe that's what uh, they're looking. Uh, but let's go create some content. I'm actually excited, you know, to go make this cocktail because I can't remember the last time I made cocktail, but you know, I'm looking forward because I bought all this lovely alcohol and uh, pineapple chunks and everything ready, you know, just to make this amazing Ghana fan chip cocktail because I don't actually have the name but you know I just want to mix a lot of uh, fruit juice and alcohol together and then produce some amazing like banga you know some amazing cocktail it's not Pond Star Martini but it's going to be Ghana fan chip Martini or Ghana fan chip Caroyal 
Ghana fan tube, sexy wall banger. It could be, it could be anything. So, so tell me, guys, where are you watching from? Are you watching the content from the UK? Are you watching from Ghana? Where are you watching the content from? And the time right now is four. It's a uh, nine minutes past four, and I'm just heading home. We're going to make cocktail and oh the christmas lights on early i think i need to flip the camera give me a second let me see if i could do it oh there's cars behind me oh my god uh, i can't do it yeah all right yeah so the christmas lights on it's very early probably because it's dark yeah normally they put it on uh, later but you know it's kind of the weather is dark so they kind of welcome to another episode of can i find you so today we're going to make a custom christmas cocktail this cocktail is called christmas horses why it's called christmas horses i will explain i always believe that this reindeer looking thing that you see everywhere during christmas i always believe they should be like horses because they are family of horses so that's why this cocktail is called Christmas Horses. So what we're going to use today? We're going to use fresh pineapple, orange juice with bits, cherry liqueur, and a vanilla vodka, and a slice of lime. I'll do that later. So before you prepare the cocktail, what we have to do is we have to prepare the glass ready so by doing so you have to make sure you get your ice ready yep the ice is all ready now we just have to open the pineapple chunks i'll probably get about quarter of the pineapple in there because i'm only making one one uh, drink so Probably six of these chunks will make it a quarter, I believe. If you agree with me, please do leave a comment uh, below. All right. All right, so that's a quarter. Let's get this juice in. All right. And also, I'll make sure I get about a quarter of this juice this juice shake it very well because it comes with a bit it's not like a smooth one where you just pour you have to shake this one so i'm going to pour it very very slowly now our next bit is the vanilla vodka i'm going to use the measure because it's always good to use a measure when you're doing this kind of cocktail so that you know the amount of alcohol you consume it. So I'll use uh, this measure, only one shot. I think you make a nice cocktail. So let's go. So now we're ready to make Christmas horses. Are you ready? <laughs> Let's make Christmas horses. You have to make sure you press this bit because you don't want the cocktail to go everywhere. All right. You ready? Oh my God. I told you, you have to make sure you press it. Oh God, it's feisty. Ooh. God, that's very scary. All right, so I think the cocktail is ready, but let's let's just blend it a little bit. I think I like the sound of the thing. All right, so I think it's ready. All right, let's get it out. All right. Make sure we place it very nicely. Now the cocktail is all ready. Now let's pour it very nice, nicely. Look at that. 
That's what you call Christmas horses. It's a special made by Ghana Fanship. Look at that. Oh my God, that's divine. Right, so now we place the blender back to position. We have to make sure we out our cherry brandy, which is here. Uh, we're going to use the small measure just to make sure we don't spoil the beautiful Christmas horses cocktail. So we're going to measure using the small uh, measure. Slowly drip it in there. Oh my God, that's a failure, but it's all right. We all make mistakes sometimes. It's our first time, it's okay. Right, so now I'm going to slide my lime. I have to make sure I slide it very, 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 very nice. Okay, I slice. And I'm going to cut it into half. Now I'm going to get my little cocktail thing which is in the thing here. So here's my cocktail thing. I don't know what it's called, but if you know what it's called, please do let me know in the comment section. Just going to pinch it and then put it here, put it here. And there is my straw. That's how you make Christmas horses. I'm going to have it because if I don't have it, you think I'm just making it for YouTube. So I'm going to have it. My reaction will tell you whether it's delicious or not. Oh my God, but wait, I think I need to stir to fill that cherry liqueur. Let's have another zip. Oh my God, this is called Christmas horses. I'm, I'm telling you, just go to the kitchen right now and make yourself Christmas horses. This is 